a real quick question, Coach. Uh, most people may not know this, but you played a prison guard in the Adam <laughs> Sandler movie, The Longest Yard. Yes. My question is, what was it like making a movie with Burt Reynolds? That's, that's, no, that's a great question. So I'll tell you how I got that part. So I played, I played five years in the NFL, and then, and then I was out. I was out of football. So I was really trying to get back into football. And so I ended up playing arena football in Austin, Texas, which if anybody's been to an arena football game, they're unbelievable games. And I had so much fun. I played three years of arena football. My first year in Austin, we were playing the Tampa Bay Storm. Well, I didn't know this at the time, but the assistant coach on the Tampa Bay Storm was a guy named Pat O'Hara. Pat O'Hara was a, like a casting director for Paramount. They were looking to cast white receivers for me because I was on the, I was on the prison guards team. And so they were looking for a guy that could play football and was a white receiver. And so I remember getting a phone call. We had just finished the season. I was driving back to California, and I get a phone call. And he's like, hey, Chef, this is uh, Pat O'Hara. I, I want to know if you're interested in making a movie, an Adam Sandler movie. I thought it was a joke. I'm like, I'm like I want to be in an Adam Sandler movie. He's like, okay, that's what we're going to do. I'm going to fly you out. I'm, well, he was saying he was going to fly me. I'm like, well, I'm already driving to California. He's like, that's great. Can you be in L.A. next Monday? And I said, yeah, I'll drive down from Corona, which is my hometown. And so I drove down from Corona on Monday, and I worked out for Adam Sandler. So Adam Sandler comes out. Here comes Adam Sandler, long T-shirt, just walking out, right? And I'm going, that's Adam Sandler. And I'm like, am I working out for, for you? And he's like, yeah. So he's throwing football. So I'm running slant routes and running comebacks and running digs. And Adam Sandler is a pretty good athlete. I don't know if you guys seen him play basketball. But Adam Sandler is a pretty good athlete. So he's throwing these dimes to me. And I'm going, man, I'm catching balls from Adam Sandler right now. <laughs> and so I end up getting casted in the movie. And what, what's crazy about, I don't know if anybody's been on a movie set, but when I got the movie part, you basically, it's hurry up and wait. So your call time on a movie is like 5 a.m. So I would get up from 3 a.m. in Corona, and I'd drive down to uh, pa the Paramount lot, and we would shoot we'd shoot these scenes. But you basically get in full makeup. So I'm in full uniform. I got the paint on and everything. It's 5 a.m. in the morning, and I don't shoot till 2 o'clock. <laughs> so you're just sitting there waiting because they don't know if they're going to change. They, they got to have you, all the actors there unless you're a big-time actor. They're in their trailers, but we're sitting just hanging out. They got to have you there in case something goes wrong and they need to change something and shoot a different scene. So everybody's just sitting around kind of hanging out. And so I remember the scene we're shooting, we're shooting this scene um, where I catch a flea flicker. Who's seen the movie, Richard? The remake. So you know the guy catch a flea flicker? That's me. And if you ever look at the locker room scenes, I'm in a bunch of locker room scenes. I was kind of overacting all my parts, but <laughs> did a good job on that one. I, I remember the day that we shot the flea flicker scene, Burt Reynolds was there. I'm like, I was like, that's Smoking the Bandit over there, man. And I'm like, I got to meet Smoking the Bandit. So I was watching Burt Reynolds, and he, you know, obviously he passed away, but he was, he was great. I remember walking up to him like, hey, 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 I didn't even call him Burt. I say, hey, Mr. Reynolds, can I get a picture with you? He's like, oh, yeah, for sure, man. He's like, I played at Florida State. He told me his background, and we took a picture, and that was probably one of the coolest things. There, there was a lot of celebrities in that movie.